YouTube. Uh, Sunday, 23 January. So, first things first, I freaking hate all of you. Video's over. I don't even know where that came from. Uh, building the website this week, that's been pretty awesome. Um, got this new thing, I like this guy. So here's where this came about, look. So it's got the little Velcro things. Patch is not included. It's so the same gray here and here. So, mm. so the flip down is, so if say you're on the range, right? Let me just be stupid. So look, it'll fit your spare mags. So if you wanted, it just folds down. So you got How's your, it attached to your belt? Yeah, we're, we're gonna do all that. Are we're we gonna, gonna get to that? Okay. Minute, yeah. So the, the Velcro straps are to hold the blades in. They started life because we couldn't find a freaking box maker. But I keep my tack flashlight, my little impact defender in there. That fell on the ground. Um, <laughs> this fits <laughs> a little notepad or your cell phone. It was designed for cell phone. And yes, I drew this freaking design up. So double padded in here. This is the mil spec nylon and the super heavy duty zippers. So allow me a moment to get nude. So it's got belt loops on it that go up to a two inch belt. Hmm. I see. So you've got belt loops on the back, a D ring, it's a metal D ring on the back and all the Molly attachments. So the padding one is to keep it comfortable and two, so that if you've got your cell phone and you drop it, it's not gonna bust your cell phone or your stuff. And a lot of you guys understand why something like this is needed. So you're on vacay, right? And yes, I used vacay because all of a sudden I turned into uh, an effeminate dude. Not true. And the fanny pack of the 90s is pretty effeminate dude. So I don't like them. If you need to carry your wallet, and stuff, they're not taking this off. So these, oh yeah, check that out. Not only is this made in the USA, it's made in Georgia. Yeah, you've been talking to the guys that are actually yes. sewing it by hand. Yeah, with sewing machines, their hands on the machines. Well, they're they're, they're, they're handmade, pretty much putting it together yeah, by hand. Yeah, so it's been great. You designed it, I can vouch for it. Yeah, she's seen the email, she's seen the prototypes. My daughter stole the prototypes because they loved them. Um, there's a longer one for our bigger blades that are coming too. But if you want to hook this on could your Could that molly, double as a wallet too, if you it, wanted it, it to? It could, because a lot of dudes carry a lot of stuff during the day. And it's not fair that you camera wives have freaking purses. And we have stuff we need to carry. We have pockets. And pockets, man, look. <laughs> I wear, see these underneath here? I wear suspenders under my t-shirt. Because I've got heavy stuff and I don't want to like, be dropping trial in front of everybody so your pockets get heavy and weighted down especially if you're doing i don't want to say war games but you if sound you're like you're field, trying to sell some but you really just made this for yourself but yeah, it is going to be available me, but i'm going to put them available yeah because i wanted really something wanted to keep the knife in it's not just a stupid ass box and let me tell you boxes let 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 camera wife might chime in on this crap right here we had to rent a dump trailer <laughs> thing because we had a effing mountain. Look, that's a mountain. Our box mountain dwarfed Taylor's Ridge. Not for real, but you're I'm talking you, about when we order packages and we have lots of boxes. Lots of boxes. And I don't want a stupid knife box that I paid to put my stupid logo on with my stupid face for you to throw it in a stupid trash. So it's actually made to be useful um they're too expensive to make to include with every blade but i'm going to put them for order these have the lifetime warranty just like the rest of our stuff all american made materials heavy duty stuff so this is the tkl tech bag is that what the collab's going to go in or are you haven't decided on that yet I haven't decided i thought maybe the collab blades we're going to be, this was going to be included, but because we make it in America and because... Well, you could just do it as an add-on. Yeah, it's going to have to be an add-on. Sorry, but <laughs> they're freaking awesome. Um, I did have one. 
until my daughter stole it. <laughs> so um, now I'm waiting on the first batch to come in. So this attack bag, the molly and all that is so you can hook them on your gear. So if you want to put it on, it fits perfect on the side of an Alice pack. That's where I'm going to keep mine. And I'll, it was designed for that top fold down. And you can stuff a bunch of stuff in the thing. It's got one inch on either side so you can really and it's heavy duty so that's what's up with that um we're almost done with the website work on the tarani blades there's four blades people there's four um that's that that may just be may just be it there's like a million point four things that i was going to speak about but it just turned into a hey here's a neat little fanny pack <laughs> replacement I think they're pretty cool. You can let me know if you think they're well, cool. Well, I mean, the, the Tarani blades are coming soon. The, the first. Collab. The first. February. That is, are there 31 days in January? You're going to put out a, put it out on the Yeah, so the pre-order stuff's going to be announced through the newsletter. So don't be dumb and refuse to be on the newsletter. It's not like it hurts you to not read the freaking thing. You know, don't be hateful. You miss your opportunity for the first set. It looks like there's going to be 40 of each of the four blades. And I'm not just saying this to create buzz. The buzz is out there. If you guys know about Steve, his following is massive. And he is every single week teaching courses to... He knows this stuff. A lot of people. So all of those people that have been in these courses in the last six months since we've been building this blade and designing it and testing they're ready to order it and these are a lot of SWAT guys a lot of PD a lot of our military people people that need a how do I put this eloquently there's certain blades that work better for peeling someone off of you you know what I'm saying so something that's close quarters and you can access it easily apparently there's a duck or a human faking to be a duck. It didn't sound like a real duck. We got people building houses <laughs> next door, so I don't really give a duck. <laughs> oh, how stupid is this guy? Um, oh yeah, I didn't wear my contacts today because Sunday is let the eyes breathe day. And biscuit and gravy day. Yeah, I mean, I make some mean ass biscuits and that ain't no joke. Look, this... <laughs> This, this is biscuits. This is body by biscuits. <laughs> body by biscuits. That is the next T-shirt. What the hell with TK and eyes? Just a biscuit right here on the belly. Body, belly, booty. They really are the best biscuits. They're pretty damn good. They're good. Buttermilky and flaky and. Matter of fact, I think I'm gonna go get fatter after we're done with this and eat some leftover biscuits. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah not only does it build blades body by biscuit uh, look at that baby by biscuit these biscuits will make you have some baby you know what I'm talking about are we selling blades or biscuits today who the hell knows um, is that all you were going to talk about <laughs> probably I'm sure you had some ideas I had a bunch of ideas I can't believe then... people watch these they're so unorganized <laughs> I think that's the beauty. And it's my, anybody that actually knows me. <laughs> oh, yep, that's him. Talked to a guy I used to work with at the railroad, and he's like, oh, yeah, that's you, man, <laughs> on the video. You're insane. Actually, two railroad guys. Um, I would name drop if people like that sort of thing. I think it's pretty lame. Hey, user 42768, thanks for the kind word. Bleep that, blur that out. Can you do that? If you feel like editing your video. I am not doing that. I am not editing it in. Shh. I bleep myself. Um, I'm going to put a video out this week on me with the new heat treat cutting a nail in half. Because So when can people see the, is the content live already? The, the content will be live on the, the first. So the website content, seven days will be live and it's gonna be all the the collaboration stuff it'll be all the collab stuff so steve's describing 
how they're deployed because will there be videos then hopefully we hope the videos are in process of and those of you that are big time gun guys and know the shooting world and the competition shooters um you'll know the dude that's doing the draw videos on them um one thing that's pretty neat the she's are going to be selectable for three five and seven pound draw like a firearm because let's face it i mean if you conceal carry a, a firearm you probably conceal carry a blade and these are designed for that close quarters get off you know this ain't this ain't chopping trees down you know what i'm saying this is last ditch it's hit the fan, my back's against the wall, and it's me or you, bruh. Or, guh, I guess. <laughs> we don't get kicked off YouTube. Get off me, guh. <clears throat> anyway, what an idiot. Um, four blade types, all that description is going to be on there. He's supposed to show the videos. We're hoping to get those. Y'all don't understand if you've never built a website. It's hard, man. <laughs> it's hard. It is so tough. Uh, that's why it's always changing. The orders, pre-orders, those are going to ship in March. Probably before March. But we're giving a good six weeks just in case somebody's stupid and UPS loses some shit or something. I shouldn't have said that. Now UPS is going to lose $40,000 worth of blades. Uh-uh. First, first is stiffness. Oh yeah, look, here's the challenge coin. I think you showed that last time, didn't you? I just happen to have one in my pocket. Uh -huh. and I don't have a memory whatsoever. <laughs> I hurt my tooth. Did you hear it? <laughs> anyway, I got one guy sent me a coin. That's really cool. Um, that's it. I'm gonna scratch my face, and we're gonna bid you adieu, bye.